All right, positive starts to the week for the pound, which saw a huge boost this morning. If we look at GBP USD, that's the pound against the dollar, we can see that the price gapped up and has pretty much continued that bullish momentum throughout today so far. Now this is because of somewhat positive news about Brexit negotiations. So let's check it out and see what's been going on. Hey guys, it's Nicholas and welcome to Market Movers, where we cover the news that's been moving the markets. Now, this past weekend was meant to be yet another big one for Brexit negotiations, but as we've come to expect by now, the deadline was moved once again. And that was part of the reason for the positive reaction in the pound. You see, on Sunday, Boris Johnson, the UK Prime Minister, and Ursula von der Leyen, the President of the European Commission, announced that they'd be extending the talks beyond the weekend as there was a glimmer of hope. One EU official said that they've made incremental progress on all fronts, so, you know, it's not much, but it's definitely better than saying there's no deal. However, Boris has still said that the most likely outcome will be no deal, so this whole situation delaying the deadline once again may not change things that significantly, especially as all comments coming out of negotiations so far have been that the EU and the UK are still far apart on the core issues. And of those core issues, it seems in particular that the fishing waters are a big problem in terms of the quota rights and principle of access for the EU countries to UK fishing waters. And you may recall that last week, in fact, Boris Johnson briefed that he had the Royal Navy on standby to stop any EU boats operating in British fishing waters if there was no deal. Now, although that sort of extreme statement is likely to just be political theatre, it definitely doesn't make things any easier. There are only three weeks now until the transition period is over and they'll be reverting to the WTO rules, so time is seriously running out. Now, it seems they have until Christmas to ratify any deal. British MPs, members of parliament, have been put on notice to be ready in the week before Christmas to pass the legislation that would be needed to make the deal happen. And the European Parliament is also ready for an emergency sitting. So the stage is set for something to be done before Christmas. But since the EU have said that talks won't be wrapped up in just a day or two, it looks like we really will be going right down to the wire as pretty much everyone expects, I think. It's this brinkmanship that just dominates politics. So while the pound is bullish at the moment, it could easily reverse course. And I personally would expect it's going to take significant progress on negotiations or an announcement of no deal to see it meaningfully push out of the trend channel that it's been trading within. So keep an eye on that. We'll of course keep you updated on any news that comes in. But until then, we'd really appreciate it if you'd hit the like button, share this video with anyone that might want to stay informed about this topic or any other market moving news. And of course, let us know your thoughts in the comments. Do you think a deal can be done? Place your bets in the comment section down below. And as always, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.